Hello everybody and welcome back to an episode of the new safe hour. We are jumping in again and we are continuing the streak and this time we are going to try and do a greed, greedier run with Eve. Let's give that a go. We haven't played Eve on greedier yet um, and while she's a bit of a rough character, I do enjoy her uh, her play style and I don't know, our streak might be a little bit doomed at this point. We'll see. I mean, I'm not particularly happy with that. Let's, let's be honest. I think... This calls for taking devil deals, which I'm not particularly partial to in in uh, greedier mode runs, but... Hey, her. Right, at least we can do this. Oh, hello. What the fuck was that? Shot speed up. Paralysis. Whatever. Okay, well, this worked out. This thing can blow up and hurt us, so let's be careful. Okay. Um, plus one life, you revive with four hearts on revival. If you've taken any devil deals, spawn a hostile angel boss, which will drop two items from the devil room pool. If you've never taken a devil, instead spawn an item from the angel room pool on revival. This seems like a very much sort of let's kill ourselves moment. Let's uh, let's wait until the near the end of this floor at least, shall we? While well, we've got this damage bonus going, we might as well keep it. Because um, I think it will revolve us in four red hearts, not just four hearts. So. Oh, the crows are going to be quite good um, with this because we start with the the crow trinket as well as the uh, crow item. I think it's on kill you have a chance to spawn a crow, so we could get a little army going, to be honest, if we uh, stay in the room long enough, which I quite like the idea of. Ah, oh, that was kind of stupid. Oh, Job's Rags is actually not great. <laughs> okay, all in all, this wasn't a great idea, because basically what I should have done is I should have killed myself on the devil deal. But then again, now I guess I can go Angel. It's it's all round not not great. <laughs> I, don't I think I'm still gonna take Angel deal to be honest. Angel deals are just way better. And I need my HP. I don't know why I got that item so early. Like that that was weird. It just spawned. Alright, you were nice and easy for us, lovely. So we'll ignore that for now. Um, Honestly, I'm not interested in either of those. I guess bigger tiers and then see what's underneath, but it's a bit of a risk. Transform a random monster in the room into a harmless pig. It has a chance proportional to the number of enemies in the room to transform you instead. If you get transformed, then all stats down and the bell breaks until the next room. That sounds fucking dreadful. <laughs> there ain't no way I'm ever using that. Wow, that is an awful item. I'll gamble. Oh my god. Eh, yeah, I'll gamble. Ugh. This has been gross. I'm depressed about how this has gone. We got clear rune. That could be interesting. It gave me a card! What kind of bullshit is this? <laughs> Excuse me, one minute. Give clear rune. That's more fucking like it. Bitch. <laughs> Come on now. Give me a card. You can't give me a card. It's, it literally gives you a rune every time. What, what was that about? Uh, we got two items here. I am completely unsure as to why, but I will take both. Right, let's use Job's Rags as much as we can. Job's Rags is actually going to be pretty good, to be honest. We'll get to use it for a good amount of time. So we'll be in the same room for the most most part. Won't be doing any traveling, so... I guess it's, I guess it's actually a pretty goddamn amazing item when you think about it. Just an insane fire rate boost for the vast majority of the floor. 
gotta remember, my tears look massive. That does not mean my damage is high. Just land, you prick. You're wasting time. Valuable time. I really hope these babies die soon. And that's a sentence I didn't think I'd find myself saying too often in life. But um, the, the sound they're making is infuriating. Just fucking shut up. <laughs> I don't give a shit. You don't need to scream every time you fire. You're already dead. You're in heaven. Well, you're not in heaven. But you're angels. You are in heaven. Chill. Chill, little. What the fuck kind of spawn was that? Spawned on me and immediately nuked me. I'm quite liking this uh, thing we've got with clear room going on. Do you think I I gambled with a cheating bit of kind of cheated a little bit with the um, respawning it back in? It always gives you a rune, and I I got a random rune, so I feel fairly justified. Oh, we got angel wings as well. Oh, baby. Oh my goodness. Right. Kev Torn. I think I'll take that. We got a piece of cheese. <laughs> um. Got the key. Not bad. Not bad. I'll take booster pack. Judgment. Fool. We'd have to lose our soul. Oh my god. Right, just get these cars out of the way because they're pissing me off. You go. You go. And... You can go here. This is tricky. I think I'm just going to use this and then take... Um, like All enemies in the room with freezing. Okay. We'll do that. Ooh, also as well, let's do this. Let's go boom and Really? None of these are gonna give me any money? There you go. What is one cent for this? Just a few pennies is all I wanted. And we'll grab that. The clearance a bit useless now, but this could give us a lot of money, so I'm intrigued. All right, down we go. So basically, probably not going to use King Midas next floor, because we've got a lot of wisps right now, and I feel like they're just going to destroy everything. Don't know where uh, those hearts came from, but I'll accept them. Kev Torn has definitely made our damage better, but it still isn't great. There's some crazy knockback going on right now. Oh my god. You guys are nuking everything. I love, I love the angel item thing. With the feather shots, piercing is great. All the extra effects you get on double taps is cool too. The only one I don't like is this one that spawns the little angel baby. I wish that one didn't exist. Roll through the better ones like that. The god headshots. Okay. We are just rinsing through the run right now. I don't know why, but my greed mode runs always seem to be really overpowered. <laughs> Got some sort of special power when it comes to greedy mode. Nice. We'll try and get our angel deal. Although I'd be okay with the devil deal at this point, but I'm really hoping for angel. Oh, my lost soul. Oh, that's where I got my in my um, eternal heart from last time. I kind of forgot lost soul existed. My bad. Go 
Good, good purity is pretty amazing for us here. Didn't get the greatest aura to start with the. Grab all of those. Um, SMB Superfan is probably pretty good. We'll take that. Prank Cookie's under there. I'd like Prank Cookie very much, so. No! I just need one penny game. Just one penny. Skinny odd mushroom, I think I'll take. Oh! The one penny for the prank cookie. I'm sorry, item room prank cookie is better. It just is. And we shall go down. I think we're ready. Okay, this floor, we don't kill anything for as long as possible. Which is going to be tricky. Yeah, I'm sorry, Lost Soul, you went, you went long for this world on this mission. I'm surprised I haven't been hit yet. Okay, there you go, finally. Alright, one more wave. Okay, that worked pretty well. That worked pretty well. We got a good amount of extra money there. Well, not, not a ton, but considering it only cost us like a heart, I'd say it went pretty well. I also like the room being gold. It's pretty. Did I do a question of the day today? I don't even know. This, this episode's going quick. Um, question of the day. Why am I a moron? I don't know. Um, what's a what's a special talent that you have that you consider good that you don't think other people would? Something that's maybe maybe a bit useless, but it's your special talent. Everyone's got one. I, I feel like that could be interesting. I always like reading about this sort of stuff, finding out weird facts about you people, and also it's the internet, so people are more willing to admit to uh, being very strange. <laughs> It's not like, it's not like it's in person. Ooh, good old Mum's Heart. How does this version of Mum's Heart work here? Like, can you stop raging, my guy? Ow, that was a, a good shot. You've spawned another boss. You can't be doing that. Right. You are dead. Good. You are dead. Angel deal. Hello. Divine intervention. Kind of meh. And in here, we shall grab lead pencil. Hell yes. GMO corn, but not yet. Pop in here. That's better than a clear rune right now. I'm sorry, but it is. More fire rates. Lovely. Although it didn't give us any fire rates. That's nice. Uh, I'm going to buy this, open these two up, hope for something better than all that crap, sadly. Buy GMO corn. Speed up. Okay, we get out of here. We skedaddle skadoodle. Can't believe this, this is a, this is a fast and speedy episode, my guys. Sun card is very valuable for the boss fight. Road Rage is kind of whatever. Oh, I love that rainbow laser beam. Yeah, grid mode runs are always going to be a bit speedy. I, I realize they're not everyone's favorite, but we're trying to do our um, completion max. So I think it's always like worth doing throwing a run in here and there. It's it, like, they're good for a few reasons. Like, for one, they, they can just be fun when you get some interesting synergies. It is all also nice to, like, be able to have sort of this schedule 
so obviously the way that I record my episodes, those of you, those of you that don't know, is I, I sort of record them in and amongst my work day because I work from home. So I can like normally do them when there's a lull or like when I know I'm going to be sort of off for a little while or during my lunch, whatever. And so if I know that I haven't, not, I haven't got like, say I've only got like 40 minutes, 45 minutes, sometimes I can't always guarantee a regular run will fit into that time. So I'll be like, okay, I can definitely fit a greed mode run into that time. It's very, very rare a greed mode run goes over sort of 35 minutes. So I do quite like the fact that we have the option to do short runs. And obviously it's the completion marks as well. We do get good like unlocks and stuff from it. Well, the whole point of this is we're trying to uh, re-unlock everything. So we're going to be throwing greed mode in. What I need to do is I need to get back to doing some challenges. I've not done challenges in quite some time. And there's, there's quite a few interesting ones that... Um, I did all the boring ones off camera. But there's quite a few um, interesting ones that we start to do, like Bloody Mary and stuff like that. What was this? What's, what's, what's this goofball doing? Why is Gish so difficult now? Oh my God, Gish, chill out. Why you gotta be so gish? Um, I don't really think any of that's super worthwhile. Look how buff I am. Eve is hench. Loaded dice is always a fun one. Taking damage increases range. Um, for the rune taking damage increases shot speed for the floor. Interesting. Um, none of that's useful to us. Loaded dice is interesting, but I don't think it's worth it this late into the game. This is good. We'll definitely take this. I think we'll go. Right, down we go. Let's see how speedily we can get through this. <laughs> Look at us with the rags on and stuff. That's hilarious. I feel like a moron. A beautiful, beautiful moron. Ah, my little ghosty boy. He can never live. He's not long for this world. It's sad times, but he is not. Oh, don't hit me with that. God damn it. Luckily, we can still kill from up here. Oh, do you know what? I, I took electric dice. Like, yeah, we can get extra soul hearts. We're literally completely full on red hearts. I didn't know that. I thought we had a few slots left for soul hearts at least. Stupid oh. I we could get a different active item this floor that could be good with electric dice for the boss fight. Give me sprinkler, maybe. I'd be down with a sprinkler. This guy's just healing everyone. He's need him to die. I can't kill him. He's, he's too bouncy. There you go. We finally got him. He just kept bouncing away from me every time I hit him. Nightmare. I love how hench I am. Oh, it's so funny. The body uh, visuals from that mod are just so good. 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 Take out all of these hairs. Oh, God. Oh god, we've got the whips on me. I got them confused for the stationary ones. Use the band dimension where we can. Yet another angel deal. This is kind of tricky. Um, we don't have anywhere generating blue flies right now. I think we'll probably go for this instead then. Right, hoping for an active item here. Pretty good, I'll take. Do I want to take it? It is extra damage. I think I should probably take it. Black hole. Removes the negative effect of using sinful jewels if it has one. Interesting. Darn tootin. Run anything I can grab here. Right. Away we go. It's boss time. It's the big bad. Don't know how long this ba this guy will take, but we'll see. What? Excuse me? What the fuck happened there? <laughs> I'm so confused. Right, just remember we do have a sun card. 
I'll, I'll end up forgetting, so I need to keep reminding myself. We do have a sun card, so we can get a lot out of that. Sun card can be very much heavily used for um, the big heals. You can also do a bit of damage as well, but the big heals is all we care about right now. Yeah, we're, do we're doing pretty good damage here. I don't think we're going to have to worry. I like the fact that we can use Divine Intervention to like push him away a little bit as well. Divine Intervention is an item I really, really underrated for a long time. It's only after that run a few months ago that I was like, wait a minute, this item slaps. Because like you can push enemies into walls and like away from you. It's not just for reflecting projectiles. You can also kind of use it as like a close range blast. Like you push enemies away. This is a key free zone, my guy. Oh no, he got one key. How dare you. I thought I had him on lock. Apparently not. Yeah, like, obviously this is a really dumb question to ask this late into a video that's greed mode. But how many of you actually, like, enjoy watching greed mode? And how many of you, like, just click off if it's a greed mode video? Because, obviously, the thing is, most people that do click off if it's a greed mode video are gone by now. <laughs> most people that don't enjoy it are also probably gone by now. But it'd be interesting to know. I d I, like I said, I do like doing greed mode here and there. I know there is, like, a sort of dedicated few of my audience, so there's a few hundred of you that, that do really enjoy greed mode, um, and have asked for more of it, so I know that there is still demand for it, which is why, I, I mean, I still play it for completion max, but it's why I'm still okay with uploading it rather than just doing it off camera, because, I mean, I, I've started to enjoy playing it more with some of the mods we're using and stuff that improve greed mode. Mainly the one I made, because I made it, ha ha ha. Do you want to chill out, my guy? Do you want to just, like, calm your tits for a bit? It's insane. It's good. I'm pretty uh, looking forward to this weekend. It's my girlfriend's birthday next weekend. But this weekend, um, well, th that weekend when it's her birthday, her parents are coming down. Uh, so this weekend, we're going to be doing sort of all of our birthday stuff with friends and stuff. So tomorrow, we're going into town and going to get some food and stuff. And then going to come back and, like, have snacks and watch some films. Um, we're gonna go to like a record shop because she's gotten into sort of buying records recently So I'm gonna get her a few records for um For her birthday um, And then a record player for Christmas because we've got a lot of records. We do not have a record player it, Mainly because it's kind of like more buying the art Which is I think why a lot of people collect them, but we actually thought you know what we could actually at some point play these as music <laughs> um, So I'm gonna buy a record player for Christmas as well, but then yeah the day after We've, we've got sort of the, the birthday thing we're doing with friends and stuff, so we've um, booked a place called the Hip Hop Chip Shop that is like a fish and chip place that, oh my god, it's just unreal. It's so good. I'm really looking forward to it. It's going to be amazing. Black Feather Crow Heart, good stuff. There you go. A nice little winnie din din. A winner dinner dinner. I hope you guys did enjoy, but yeah, let's take a little look at our challenges and see what some of the other ones we have going for us are. So we've done quite a lot of them here, as you can see. We've got Brains, which is... Yeah, we could do Brains next, I think. We've got Pong, Bloody Mary, Baptism by Fire. We haven't actually done the Super Corrupt Challenge yet either, uh, which people always find fun. So maybe we can do that. Um, either way, I hope you guys did enjoy. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.